Hey yo everyone, welcome back to the channel and uh, as you've seen in my previous video, we did open the uh, Beast Fire it starter deck and now we are going to open the 7 Warlords of the Sea starter deck. So without further ado, let's begin! Alrighty guys, so for today's video, we are opening the uh, 7 Warlords of the Sea starter deck. So yeah, before we open this, uh, if you are living in the Philippines, so uh, I got this from Hobby Collect. So I'll be putting the uh, link in the description below if you would like to uh, get one yourself. So yep, let's start the opening. So I will not show the uh, play paper play mat. So as we've uh, we've. Uh, I showed it to you in the previous video so we're just gonna go straight with the decks all right so yeah this is the paper playmat we've uh, checked that before in the previous video so yep all right so this is the first uh, first half of the starter deck for the seven warlords of the sea so yeah uh, where's the all right here it is so there you can all you can all, uh, see don dofi don flamingo so the finish of the card is much cooler here as you can see the hollow effect and then the uh inscription or the design at the border is so much cooler so I believe we will be getting two Dofis in this starter deck, right? The quality of the card as mentioned in, uh, as I mentioned, it's superb. This is much, I, I believe, I think the design here is much cooler than Dragon Ball Super and Digimon. So that's my opinion, but yeah, uh, I don't want to, I don't want to uh, make any confusion from the uh, fans from Digimon and Dragon Ball Super so here we have three copies of this I uh, know I believe four and then we have here Jinbei four copies of Jinbei and then we have four copies of Lo character card here we have Kuma four copies <laughs> here we have the new warlord if you the new yonko so buggy then another kuma four copies as well and lupi's baby girl we have here uh boa all right that's the other half and let's go to the main pack which is the which has the uh, leader card so as mentioned in the starter deck if you buy one you'll be getting 10 dot cards as you'll need 10 dot, car dot cards to play the game so yeah I, I'm having a hard time getting it so let's get the 10 dot card first out of the way so these are the 10 dot cards alright so yeah the leader card here is Crocodile. You can see that. So you can see the map of the One Piece world at the background. So the log post here, really cool. So yeah, leader card Crocodile. And then, yep, we will be getting uh, the SR version of Crocodile. Two copies of this, right? All right, so here we have, I believe we, this is two copies of Gecko Moria. I think that's his name. And then this guy who beat Soro, Mihawk, two copies. And here, two copies, I forgot her name. And then two copies of Blackbeard. Let's go. So here we have the event cards. You can see here uh, Crocodile with his skill. I think is that I think that's a kind of at the back right 
four copies of this and then we have here Kumas Palm Technique that's Soro over there and we have here Luffy with Boa so the love love beam I, I believe <laughs> so yeah two copies of this one alright so yeah as you can see guys we have here the uh, SR of the uh, starter deck we have here Dopey and then the character card of Crocodile look at these cards I'm seeing myself opening lots of booster box just to complete the first set alright so that's the two SRs two types of SR included in the starter deck for the seven uh, warlords of the sea and the leader card crocodile alright so the leader card will always be red at the back and for the normal cards blue alright so yeah everyone thank you for uh, staying until the end of the video so the next starter deck will be the worst generation starter deck all right see you on the next one bye bye <laughs>